Hey you! I hope you're doing well. Today I'm going to show you my favorite recipe for a zucchini soup. It's really nice and creamy, really flavorful and perfect as a side dish. So let's get going. Okay, so here I've got some uh, zucchinis which I've cut up in sort of quarters. Now what I'm going to do is to season them and then roast them in the oven. Um, one of the biggest rules for making a good soup is to roast your vegetables before you blend them with the other ingredients because it's going to bring out the flavor of the vegetable even more. Especially if you don't have that many ingredients, you want to make sure that you um, embellish the flavor as much as possible. So let's season this and then we're going to pop them in the oven. Okay, let's start with a bit of salt and pepper. Then I'm going to add a little bit of onion and garlic powder, not too much because the zucchini is quite of a subtle taste and onion and garlic powder will really um, overtake it if you put too much of it. So really just a little bit. Okay, that's enough. Yep. And then a generous amount of thyme. Rosemary will work really well in this recipe as well, but I prefer thyme over rosemary. All right, and now for the oil, I'm going to use macadamia oil. Okay, to make sure that the vegetables are nicely coated, I'm just going to, um, I guess, baste them with this little tool here. Perfect. These go in the oven for 35 minutes at 190 degrees. All right, my zucchinis are nicely roasted. Now what I'm going to do is to blist the whole thing together with a few ingredients. I'm just going to transfer that into a pot first. Perfect. Now from here, it's very simple. I have my zucchinis here in the pot. I'm just going to add some uh, chicken stock. I normally would say you have the choice between vegetable stock and chicken stock, but in this recipe, chicken stock works the best. Perfect. And also a few dollops of cream. All right, all done with the zucchini soup. You will notice that it's not as green as you would think. That's because I removed the skin of the zucchini. Something I forgot to mention earlier is that I always peel my zucchinis because sometimes the skin can be quite bitter and you definitely don't want that in your soup or any other recipes, in fact. Um, so yeah, I removed the skin and that's why the color is not as green, but it tastes amazing. Actually, I'm gonna taste it now. <laughs> Wow, how can zucchini taste so good? <laughs> so a few serving suggestions with that would be as a side dish with like some protein, like chicken, a slice of crusty bread with some olive oil. It would go really well together, but I like to also have it um, as a snack. Cool. Mm. Beautiful. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Mwah.